Whoops, I know snow leopards shouldn't be here. But if we don't save snow leopards, the only place snow leopards will exist will be the digital games like this one, online in the internet. So save snow leopards! <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to Dreamer Learner Maker. My name is Isadora and I'm 10 years old. If you know me, I'm back again. This video will be the start of a series of endangered animal videos. The purpose is to bring awareness to how much danger they're in and how we can help. In these videos, I'll be using Blender. Blender is a 3D software used for animation, visual effects, sculpting, and 3D printing models, and a lot more. You can use my models to print them or put them into a game by animating it. I'm using Blender in sculpting mode to make these models. That is what you see in the background currently. This video will be about snow leopards, which is in the endangered category. All of these videos will be in time lapse and while I'm sculpting in the background, I'll be talking about why it is endangered and how we can help them. I have four main reasons I want to point out. Enough of the small talk, let's get into the big stuff. The snow leopard is endangered mainly because of humans. Number one, humans push the large groups of livestock into their habit. The livestock end up overgrazing, leaving less and less food for the wild animals like the wild goats and sheep, which is the snow leopard's main source of food. In breeding season, they need this food to tend their young and not just themselves. The prey will need to move constantly to find more food because of the overgrazing in sections. The snow leopards also need to move too because there is where they can find more prey for themselves and their young. And the young might yet not be able to handle all this moving. Number two, now for the disgusting part. The bones, skin, and organs of large cats is an ingredient for traditional Asian medicine. Even though they prefer tigers, they are also endangered and protected, and they are super hard, rare and hard to find in the wild. So snow leopards act as a substitute in these medicines. Number three, the sad part. Bounty hunters and poachers can get up to $10,000 just for a dead snow leopard. Also, some people who live near these large cats often get less than 300 bucks per year. That is so little if you think deeply. These cats live in cold tundras and mountains, and people who live near them get little money, nowhere like the busy streets of New York or any other famous city or suburban. It isn't hard to understand why these large endangered cats are even endangered at all. Number four. Because they have plenty loss in their wild prey, they need to feed on the large groups of local livestock gathering around them, which an angry farmer on an early morning can eat, take revenge for by capturing the snow leopard that is only trying to, to survive. Now that you know these dangers that the snow leopard is in and facing right now, you can adjust them to the large groups and falsities like the WCS, also known as Wild Conservation Society or the Snow Leopard Trust. If you're old enough, maybe you could start your own. Even though snow leopards hunting is illegal, you know this mischievous and untrustworthy black market sellers, greedy for their own benefit and uh, uh, money. There are only about 3,500 to 7,000 in the wild, and estimated 600 to 700 in zoos around the world. I'll be listing facts that I found interesting while I was reading other articles while you watch the rest of this video. The facts will also be listed in the description of the video. Number one, scientific name is Panthera uncia. I'm pretty sure I've pronounced it right. Number two, China holds 60% of the snow leopard population. Number three, they prefer to live in ridges, cliffs, and rocky outcrops where they can blend in and hunt. Number four, the belly fur is estimated to be five inches thick. They must be toasty and warm. Number five. Snow leopard tails are almost as long as their own bodies and one very fluffy too. 
Number six, common prey, deer, gazelles, sheep, or hares, or mice, wild boars, etc. Number seven, after hunting and they're not as hungry, they may drag their kill into a snowy tunnel for safekeeping. Number eight, they are found in altitudes as high as 3,500 meters above sea level. And those are the eight facts I found. Now sit back and enjoy the rest of the video. Thanks for watching! I hope you'll take action in saving snow leopards. Now don't forget to like and subscribe! See you in the next video! Bye!